Hi, Gemini. Welcome to your quantum reading. This is for Gemini Sun Moon Rising. Welcome to my cross watchers. Cross watcher, you could be dealing with a Gemini, and the message is actually just for you. So take it however it resonates to your situation. Don't get too caught up on what that looks like. Um, all my information is down below in the description box, my website link, Instagram handle, all of that good stuff. And thank you guys so much for liking, subscribing. Thank you for all the ways that you have been here and supported the channel. Let's dive into your message. Passion. Ha ha. That's very nice. Okay, we <laughs> cleanse anger. Okay. <laughs> there he is. All right. Shimini. Um, animus. That feels directed. Okay, yeah. Whoa. I have never seen these cards come out together. Animus and Anima. I've n I've never seen them come out together in a read. <laughs> okay, so there's a definite partnership and you two are at an impasse with something in the relationship. <laughs> Straight up. Like, you're kind of like, this is how... Uh, this is how it is. This person is like... Um, they're very stubborn. They could feel like whatever their actions are, it's like you two can't get past this certain thing. They're still doing what they're doing and you're still doing what you're doing. And you guys have issues with it. It's like they have a very significant issue and this could be about some silence <laughs> sphinx pose okay so someone could be silent here maybe there's even a silent treatment but that's like this could just be in general and what a crazy combination so some of you guys could be look there's anger here <laughs> i'm just gonna say it and it's a really crazy combination because it's like both like, you guys have a very weird relationship between um, passion and your anger. Like, what? And so, someone could be trying to cleanse right now. Or, like, you know, I don't know, detox or cleanse or trying to, like, just cleanse in general. Because it could be affecting something energetically, like someone's... Okay. Oh, those are not the right cards, but that's very weird that I even pulled that. So I'm going to leave it and then we're going to get the actual cards. Okay. Nice. Okay. Yeah. I mean, these can be like health crisis or you guys could be cleansing. Like if something, it, this could have been a health issue or energetically, if you went through some kind of betrayal and there was a lot of stress around that, that could have been causing like all sorts of physical things like it could cause inflammation, skin breakouts, like stuff like that. You could be trying to cleanse of that energy. Okay person could be very strong. They have strong energy. Hanged man in the reverse. Yeah, so, um, ace of wands in the reverse. Ten of swords. Oh, Ten of Pentacles. Whoa. Ten of Wands in the reverse. Man, three tens. Uh, six of Wands. That's good. So it looks like you could be victorious over something right now, or you're getting a victory over this process. Like, you still are coming out victorious in some way. Oh, whoa, whoa. Four of Wands. Oh, look at this. Oh, I don't like 
like this. Outcome is the Fool in reverse, the Seven of Swords in reverse, the Ace of Pentacles in reverse, Three of Pentacles in reverse, the Hermit in reverse, and the Nine of Cups in reverse. Dude. Okay, whoa, whoa. Something might come to light. Okay, Seven of Swords reverse is like a truth, like a secret coming out or a truth being revealed. And some of you guys, it could be a Virgo, but I feel like there's going to be a realization here about why you weren't getting a new chapter. And it feels like it was another person that was actually trying to block that impasse. Someone could have been trying to create an impasse for you and this new beginning. At times, this person does like the silent treatment or some of you guys, this person isn't silent, but they are still very much in your energy. And it looks like when it comes to the two of you, you guys, whenever you come up into this impasse, you have two very strong reactions. Like this masculine could be following their intuition or they are kind of like reflecting the more in certain situations that you deal with them they appear like their feminine side comes out this is in this masculine there are times where you see that come up with this person you could also feel like this person is like crazy intuitive like you don't know how they know things or they just figure things out but this person's like very attuned maybe even to your energy and it looks like whenever you two come up to this situation you kind of shift into the masculine energy for those of you that are f like females you like whatever this masculine is doing if you feel like it's kind of like this person is actually trying to create a restriction for you it could even disrupt your energy here like it actually does something physically to your body and then your body is going through these natural biological responses like it, it might shift back and forth through freeze and then whenever you come out of freeze mode you shift into fight mode. Like that's when, how the masculine will come up with a feminine whenever they're like dealing with this type of situation. It's very specific. And so there could be something here where um, you're like seeing this person very differently. I'm almost seeing like this might not be for all of you, but I'm seeing like you've lost that spark toward this person or you're not like attracted to them if you were before there's something about that changing almost like you wouldn't be intimate with this person and that could be someone here in your space because some of you guys there could just be so much like the endings here were super painful and you're releasing them and I feel like that's almost a telltale sign that you you losing your appeal for this person is kind of like this official ending. Um, you could... You could be coming into a victory over your finances or you'll be receiving a lot of attention for something that you do. Like some kind of thing that you've been doing but I wonder if this person's trying to actually stop your creativity oh that's a weird side of this or it's like on a weird energetic level So it looks like you guys have had something painful happen between the two of you. And there's this impasse now. And it could have been about passion. I do feel like you're going to like figure out that a person did something out of strategy. You know, like this is one of those weird situations where a person like feels threatened the, because of the codependencies and if a person felt like someone was gonna like change someone else's perception about the relationship or help them to 
to see the clarity or go through a disillusionment. And sometimes like the person can try to trap them, you know, in some way. It could be a pregnancy or whatever. I don't even want to get into all the different things that could mean. But that's what it looks like. There's something where you're going to figure out that a person actually took action. You keep getting a victory. And it looks like it's like really affecting someone in your reality. The fact that you keep kind of like doing something well or you always accomplish something or you you could always be like center of attention for something. Like you get a lot of attention in some way. It looks like there's a person here that has like a strong reaction to that. Like, it makes them feel angry. Some of you guys, this was about a third party situation. Because you could have felt like maybe there was a person that you felt triangulated against. And so now this masculine, like, the crazy part of this is... If you try to move on, if you try to move into a brand new energy, this person is going to try everything. I almost feel like that's why all those cards at the ending are reverse. Because... It's, this person might be silently just trying to block you from moving into new energy and a new opportunity. They can't, like, and this might frustrate this person because they're going to see that you continue to get an opportunity or something keeps trying to come in toward you. It, like It's like your blessing keeps trying to find all these different avenues to come in towards you and this masculine could be trying to like block it. Like they're trying to do everything that they can, but they can't. And it's, they're having a reaction to it, but it's silence. Um, or for some of you guys, this person is like explosive and then there's like silence here. Either they feel like you go silent but, and it could be the reverse of this, where if this masculine feels like you're just completely silent, they're angry. Like, they wouldn't show this, some of you, but behind the scenes, if they're, if you guys aren't talking, they're very angry about possibly whatever this is that's going to come in for you, this victory. Oh, man. Yeah, this is like, it's like, there's, it's like, yeah, loss of attraction for someone. There's just no spark. But some of you guys, it might be good too. If this was a really crazy ending or health crisis, yeah, you might want to cleanse and just kind of like get that all out of your body, like do a really good detox or something good like that. And... I guess someone is here. You look very strong. Or there's a Leo that's going to be coming into your space. They like your intelligence. They might be very attracted to your mind. There could be an interaction that's going to come in there. Because weird that I even pulled that. Okay, yeah. Let me dive into the extended gem. If you guys want to join me over there, as always, feel free. Go down below. Click on the Vimeo link. See it over there. But... Gem, if this is where we leave things, sending you so much love. Wishing you all the very best. See you in your next reading. Take care.